Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. I want to send my sincere heartfelt condolences to the entire Smiley family. So I just made a video about black men and how they deserve to grow old. And unfortunately, the son of Ricky Smiley, Brandon Smiley, has just passed away this morning at the age of 32. 32 is so young, you guys. He leaves behind a daughter named Storm. And, you know, Ricky got on Instagram and, you know, he's always very transparent with us. So he said that he wanted to let everyone know that he's grieving the loss of his son, but he wanted, you know, people to hear from him first today. And he said that, you know, he's on his way flying to Birmingham, Alabama for, you know, the funeral. He says, and I quote, I just had a bad, I just had bad news this morning. He says, I'm on my way to the airport to get to Birmingham. I want everyone to pray for me, pray for our family. Our son, Brandon Smiley has passed away this morning. Lord have mercy, Jesus. Pray for Brandon's mother and his father, Taurus and his sister Taylor and everybody. I hate to announce this, but I just want to give it to you before you hear it in the streets. End quote. So, again, you know, I'm going to honor Ricky's wishes and just pray for his entire family. I cannot imagine the pain that would occur from a father bearing his son. He didn't tell us exactly how Brandon died, but whatever it is, you know, it can't be easy on him. During his Instagram post, you know, he kept saying, repeating that, you know, he really can't think straight. He was trying to remember his keys and if he had, you know, taken care of himself before flying out and just, I, my heart is just so broken because I can't even imagine what he's going through, especially leaving behind, you know, he has, Brandon had, has a, a daughter named Storm, who's only four years old. So Ricky goes on to say, he says, life comes with a whole bunch of twists and turns. I can't think straight. So these are just quotes that I'm reading um, from him. He says, May you keep your battles near the cross. May your struggles show that you need God. Lord, ain't that the truth? We all need God. May your battles end the way it should, and may your bad days prove that God is good. So that was what he posted on his uh, official Instagram an hour ago. Um, he has 3.9 million followers, so hopefully he can get at least 3.9 million prayers. And I'm making this video because I encourage all of you to pray for his family as well. Because again, going back to the video that I just made, if you guys check it out, I literally just posted it before making this one, but that black men deserve to get old. And 32 is such a short life. And, you know, I'm not sure what happened with Brandon. I'm sure, you know, when the details come out, I'll definitely keep you guys posted and let you know. But Ricky Smiley has been entertaining us since I can remember, since I was a little kid when I first saw him on Comic View. And his son was actually, you know, working toward following his father's footsteps, um, you know, starting with stand up, you know, comedy and making memes on Instagram. And he was always, you know, sharing funny stories and things like that. So I'm sure that when Ricky feels comfortable enough, he'll give us more information as it comes out. But man, just that pain is just, it has to be so overwhelming. And I really hope that Ricky, you know, is surrounded by love and has a support supportive team around him. I know people on his radio show, you know, Gary with the T, the Brat, um, just all his co-hosts, they all have been working with him for years. I know Gary was his, worked as his personal assistant before joining the Ricky Smiley Morning Show cat uh, crew. And 
So I really hope that he has people who love him, who can support him and just be there in his time of need because my goodness, we are losing our young men left and right, ladies and gentlemen. I just, oh my goodness, I just, I pray for his family. Please, you guys take care of yourselves and each other. If you, you know, if you have the opportunity, please, you know, check on your strong friends. I don't know if it was a sickness. I don't know if it was substance related. I don't know. I have no idea, but I just know that he's gone way too soon because 32 is really, that's so young. And my heart just goes out to Ricky because, I mean, you know, he works hard for everything that he has. He's been, like I said, doing stand up since I was a little kid on Comic View and, you know, his his one hour specials, you know, kind of with the bands and I know he was in the marching band when he was like in high school and college and all the characters that he has done with, you know, Lil Darrow and reading the church announcements. I mean, he's been putting in work and he has a, a really long comedy career for a very long time. And he's been doing the Ricky Smiley morning show. I know he took over for um, Tom Joyner, but he's been doing it for years. And so with that being said, I know Ricky brings a lot of people joy and I just want us to be there for him during his time of need and to keep him lifted up in prayer because he needs a, his whole family keep, you know, the baby girl storm, you guys lift her up in prayer and just continue to, to, um, to take care of yourselves. You know, we're going through just excruciating times. I mean, with COVID still being, you know, an issue and inflation, the prices of everything is going up with police brutality and all these culture wars and things like that. You know, mental health is so important. So please continue to be gentle with yourself. If you feel like you you know, need help, please seek it. The number 988 is a suicide hotline. And of course, I would never want um, anyone to, to go that route. But if you feel like you need someone to talk to, it's there. And they said since they've created it um, just, you know, recently, I don't even think it's a year old yet. They've gotten a lot of traction. A lot of people have called and reached out. So please do so. But yeah, keep the Smiley family in prayer because Brandon was also a fellow comedian. Oh, he did. He worked alongside his dad on the TV one show, Ricky Smiley for real. And wow, our sincere condolences to Ricky Smiley, to all of Brandon's friends and his loved ones. He will be missed. And I just, I really, truly meant what I said when I said I, I want our black men to grow old. Our black men deserve to grow old because navigating this world in a as a black woman i can tell you that it's extremely difficult you almost feel like you're walking on landmines all the time and i can only imagine that struggle even being harder and more intensified for a lot of black men in america so continue to lift up all of your brothers uncles cousins all your family members out here you know that's why we call each other brother and sister because at the end of the day we all we got. So again, praying for the Smiley family, for all of, you know, their siblings, Ricky, the little girl, Storm, and everyone out there who can hear my voice. Please keep them lifted up in prayer. Take care of yourselves, you guys, and each other. I love you. Peace. <laughs>